So Jason Hammer and I had a bet, and it was which quarterback would be taken second in the NFL draft. We all knew Joe Burrow was going one. The question is who would go two? I said Justin Herbert from the University of Oregon. He said Tua Tungavailoa from Alabama. And unfortunately, Tua Tungavailoa went fifth to the Dolphins, Herbert sixth to the Chargers. The loser between me and Hammer had to shave our head on Facebook Live. So I lost, I held up my end of the bet. So by the time this was all done, the easiest thing to do was just take a Bic razor and shave the whole thing off. So we shared the photos of my completely bald head on social media, and now we're gonna read some of your responses. From John, despite all my rage, I'm still just a rat in a cage. From Thad, I'm an old dude, so I cannot judge. My wife calls this Scary Rob and says she likes Cute Rob better. Honestly, I don't know what to do with that information. Hey Thad, little secret, Scary Rob, Cute Rob, they're one and the same. From Bev, facial hair is a must. Nice clean goatee. From Kenny, shave off the eyebrows and we can have a perfect resemblance with Wooly Willy. From Chuck, this is what all that screaming will do. From Brandon, Lex Luthor from Smallville. From Joe, just need an old panel van with free candy painted on it. You really do kind of look like a Chester. All right, all right, all right. From Tim, okay, so you did it. Don't know why. Don't do it again. And let hair grow back. Quickly, don't be dumb again. I love how people are so vicious because I followed through on a bet. <laughs> and keep in mind, the only reason I shaved my head completely was that Jason Hammer brought in these crappy shears that wouldn't properly buzz my head, and one of my coworkers, Mock, took actual scissors to my scalp. From Ginger. You scared me at first, but it's a fine look. But serious, get some sun, please. Ginger, I'm trying. The governor still prohibits it. From Pam, don't get sunburn, but if you do, vinegar works great. Even though you'll smell like salad dressing for a little bit. Oh, Pam, you never actually smelled me. From Tim, grasshopper. It is said a man with a baby face should have a lactating girlfriend. From Dennis. Oh, Dennis, this is so true. Not bad. Too bad that shaved head doesn't have a better face on it. You know, I'm actually amazed at how well I pulled this off. I mean, a lot of, a lot of women were like, Rob, you're really sexy. And it's hard to blame them. From Ari, producer of the Tony Katz Show. People are going to make fun of Rob because he's bald. But that doesn't mean people should stop making fun of him for wearing obnoxiously tight-fitting shirts. Don't be jealous, Ari. Should have painted it like an Easter egg. Lost opportunity. From Paul, I had to put on my sunglasses for the glare. You might consider wearing a hat until your hair grows back and maybe a mask. Other than that, you look great. From Heather, you look too young to pull off the bald look. Thank you, I'm actually 21. From John, it's the next Batman villain, Egghead. I'd like to thank Governor Holcomb for this whole quarantine thing. I know I've been very critical of you, but you are saving me so much money on haircuts. Maybe big government is the way of the future.